This is the time for social enterprise. Its purpose is to change the world. The time for social enterprise in the UK is now. There's never been a better opportunity for the sector. Social enterprise can be rigorous, effective and business-like in a sense and still deliver totally amazing outcomes for our society. And once you explain what social enterprise is to people, once you can actually get the message across, it clicks, they get it. And once they get it, they believe. HET is a large social enterprise providing transport and training services, and we invest the profits from the contractual side to support the social side. I mean, you could put it on the, on the side. But... So the difference between social enterprise and charity is it's using business skills, it's understanding risk, it's making a profit, and the difference between social enterprise and business is what you do with the profit. So for example, we run a accessible taxi services, we run a mobility scooters for elderly people, we train people with learning difficulties how to use public transport so they can get out about independently. Now imagine the difference that makes to someone. They can go out on their own independently when they want to and travel around. HCT has grown at a rate of around 20 to 25 percent per year for the last 10 years. If you're this big, doing that much good, imagine if you're that big, how much good you can do. My name is Rodney Schwartz and what I do is I help social businesses and enterprises to succeed. It's very simple, it's just taking the tools that I acquired perhaps rather expensively in my old life at Lehman Brothers and Paribas and UBS and other banks and we actually reach into that toolkit and try to figure out what it is that we can grab that will help a social entrepreneur to be successful. Today I'm going to visit Bikeworks. Uh, Bikeworks is quite an interesting social enterprise. It's, uh, they're at a point where they really can expand their model and I'm going to be going out and talking with them and trying to learn a bit more about their business and actually seeing how I can help them. I'm Raj Schwartz. Hi. Nice to meet you. We're really proud of what we've managed to achieve so far. We're changing lives in a whole number of different ways. We're, we're getting disadvantaged people back to work, people have been long-term employed, homeless. Uh, we're getting people active who've never had a chance to cycle. Um, we're recycling thousands of bikes. We're getting thousands more people cycling every year, so we've, we've done a lot. Um, but we want to see if we can you know, do a lot more. Bikeworks is definitely a business that I would feel comfortable backing. They've got the community development angle. They train people. They train people who are disadvantaged. They get the local community engaged. They've got a good commercial business and actually a really good vision for how to take this across London and across the UK. For many types of investors, uh, this is the kind of business that they would like. My name's Jamie Field and this is Jamie's Farm. Um, we take hard to reach young people uh, who come and stay here for up to five days and we offer them a combination of farming, therapy and family and through that process we are helping to transform behaviour. Kids in cities have extremely limited contact with the outdoors and with open space. Um, they often uh, come home from school when their parents are too scared to let them out on the street so they keep them inside. When they arrive here they're sort of overwhelmed by A, the beauty of the place and B, the space and we get children saying Sir, sir, can I run? <laughs> you say yes. You don't even know. The start! No, 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 no. And they charge off down the hill, screaming with glee. Look at the size of that sheet, man. You call that a sheet, that's a boy. We're dealing with a very big problem. These children are in every city around the country. And we, through our very professional team, managed to re-engage them with some very different activities, but in a very different environment that also allows them to reflect fully on their lives back in London. So we have statistics to prove that we, that we are having impact, that we are achieving the aims that we have set out to achieve, based on this model of, of the farm being right at the centre of it. So what all these guys and gals have is inspiration and a real vision. And these are people that have a lot of passion in what they do. And I think for any individual, working with people who have passion is incredibly rewarding. Social enterprise is the best of both worlds. So it's 
it can see a need at the same as a charity can see a need, but it uses the powers of business and the discipline of business to address that need. So it uses the powers of the market to make social change, and that has to be good for society. It all points towards the social enterprise sector, and we feel actually it's the business revolution. I think there's no way that business can continue to operate in isolation and ignore the problems in society that, that are evident all around us. And I think it's really important that business takes a role engaging with these problems and helping to find creative and sustainable solutions to them. This is definitely the time for the social business and enterprise sector and it's not a flash in the pan.